Georgia 551 and if I know my apartment has appeared several times on video and one of the things you might have seen and I'm covering a microphone because they're put in the worst possible spots is this wonderful shade that I have yes isn't that beautiful you can tell it's one of those select a size shades because over time the various areas where you can split the shade to fit a window as you can see has split up anywho that being said while I was at Andrew's favorite place Wally World I got myself a magic fit ooh and of course I'm holding it towards the Spanish side their best one with a five-year warranty white of course easy to size at home and it can go from 25 to 37 and a quarter so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to pause the video take the old shade out put it next to the new one and see if we can size it all right to make life a little easier I've skipped a few steps and one of the steps they recommended is at the end to break the support stick that goes to the bottom last to measure to the new shade. I figure while we have the old one is line up the old stick with the new one and break off what we don't need at that point. That way we can just take the stick, line it up as such, and as we can see here, right here, there's a seam. This is a telescoping rod. And what we can do is after we tear off this much of the shade, we can telescope it back. Since it does take two hands to do this, I will not be able to show you how. So we'll be back in a moment. All right, that part required two hands. Now the thing is, we got to collapse this telescoping rod, which I believe I can do while running the camera again sorry for the microphone noise it is in the worst spot possible so i'm not sure if i can do this there's the joint right there see if i can tap it in no it's not going to be that easy is it so what i'll do is i'll put it like this and of course it it cooperated oh, there we go it's going to say it cooperated on the test run there we go just a little longer there now in order to do all this sizing I had to unroll it completely so what I got to do now is roll it back up and then we'll put it in the window ooh the excitement okay we rolled it all up now the next thing to do although it's the last thing to do on the steps is to take this little support bar and put it in the bottom just like so now the last step and I'm looking because I want to be sure I get the right end facing the right way. Okay, I want the I want the knob side to be on the right, which it is. And I want the square side to be on the, the left. And we put it in. Ooh, exciting. Now, I can't... I'm aiming the camera, but I'm not looking in. I don't know if I got the aim correct. In fact, okay, I was going to... Now, put this in. And wouldn't you know it, I f***ed it all up. Well, go figures, I mess it up and cut it a little too short, but I'm not all that worried because if we look at where the shade's going to go, we can see that this end where we cut from, it's about... It's roughly an inch from the edge of the window. So the half inch we were off, no big deal. Boy, I uh, wasn't thinking about being able to save this. So all I did was re-extend that a little bit. So we saved a, we saved the shade. We're gonna try this again. Now, again, I am not looking at the camera so I'm not sure how this is going
Alright, we got that end in. And we got this end. Okay, it's still a little short, but I think I got it enough that it'll do. Again, it's not perfect. I mean, the other shade had the same problem this one does, is that you get an area that's exposed. So, I mean, that's just a hair bigger. The other one did leave that exposed as well. And we got this side covered here. Anyway, the curtain covers that anyhow. So here we have a sh brand new shade, about a half inch, a little short, but that's all right. And it's a bit crooked because we kind of followed the settling of the house. Because it would have looked, because with the curtains up, you wouldn't really see it. You got them pulled back so you can. When the curtains are in normal position, let's just, and yeah, it's a little exaggerated, but there it looks pretty normal. You don't see much of anything. You don't see the flaws. And uh, the roller is still just a hair short. I'm going to readjust that a little later. But there it is, new window shade, and I managed to save it. George F551 saying, hope you enjoyed, especially the blunders, and have a good one.